What's up, guys? Wolfcopter here once again in Dark Souls. We can wield this sword with one hand. This opens up so many new options. And also, now we can n stop focusing on strength and stuff, and now we can just focus on, like, um, endurance and health. Because I've decided that our, our person here is going to be a tank. Like, there's no two ways about it. We are a tank. I mean, we started out as a knight, so that was kind of already a given, but we are tank. Just this sword. Alright, I forgot about you. Village body. Red moss. Don't really care that much about red moss. Stops bleeding. Purple moss, though, gets rid of poison. Getting rid of poison is good. Especially where we're going to be going soon. And yay, more purple moss. Alright, let's go talk to this blacksmith guy. Because I think that we can also upgrade our sword, so it will be even more overpowered. Oh, God, I love it. Ah, slightly laggy, not sure why. Every so often, might switch over to one-handing just for, you know, old times' sake. But for now, I think that we will just... Talk to this guy. Don't remember exactly what the divine. Oh, I remember you out there. Oh, apparently I gave it to him. It's the ember of a divine blacksmith. Might you consider leaving that with me? I can produce divine weapons with a flame such as that. Sure. You've made a fight. All right. Modify equipment. Ah, uh, no weapons for ascension. Reinforce weapon then. Black Knight Greatsword plus three. Why not? God, need more twinkling Titanite though. Wow, twenty Titanite shards. I just realized. Gargoyle halberd. Yeah, I, I don't see anything that... Yeah, dragon scales is what that needs. <laughs> Straight sword hilt. Yeah, no. Right bear, no. Um, reinforced armor, though. Could actually be a good call. Oh, that requires twinkling. Well, guess we're going with the Elite Knight. Alright. Ah, now it requires large. Okay. I'm good with that. And then you leave that gauntlets. And let's do some legs just before we do anything too rash. Purchase item. Uh, we require more souls for that. You yeah, know, we could purchase more arrows. 38 more. Down to zero souls. I actually would like to see myself go hollow. I always wonder what it would be like. But yeah. Uh, rest of bonfire. So yeah, now we don't have to worry about only farming souls. And now we can continue. So, you know, three days of work paid off. And if I ever get another Black Knight weapon, I can do it again. I can use it immediately. So yeah, let's go over here. See who we've got to fight. And yes, we'll go back to the wolf, but I want a better shield first. 
And also, I want to show you. Oh. That wasn't a backstab. Whoa. Ooh, pillage. Yay, a long sword. Dang it. You were supposed to be parried. You were not supposed to hit me. You were supposed to die quickly and quietly. Now we walk slowly up to this guy. Very slowly, mind you. And then we hit him because he turns around too quickly. And parry. Ah, oh, yes. That's also the animation for the axe kills. So basically this thing has the swinging of an axe. I was really hoping that he would just, you know, run him through. Cheat, technically, actually. I keep forgetting that we're actually playing a female character. Because it has so little effect on anything in this game. Like, literally all the armor looks the same. It's only if you take off everything that you can tell. And there we go. 643 damage. I will take that. I will definitely take that. Alright, let's run back up here. I love just the fact that you carry the sword over your shoulder. Oh, oh! I have got to try that on someone. That is our new mission for this episode. To try that to strong attack on someone. And I think I found just the candidate. Nope. Yep. There we go. Mission accomplished. Ladies and gentlemen, we have accomplished our mission. And we have accomplished it twice. I, I can see times when that would be useful. Havel. You know, we haven't done Havel yet. Havel the Rock. It's a good idea. You cannot hit me. Because you are above me, and I am below you. Oh look, another rape here. Shall we take the elevator? I think we shall. So how have you guys been? You know? I've been pretty good. Like I said, I had marching band camp. Working on putting our fourth movement on the field. That was fun. Long day. We had a football game last night. We won. It was a hard fought game, but our team pulled through. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Now you're probably wondering, why is this here? Because it's part of the normal game. Because I'm still offline right now. Otherwise I would probably be getting summoned a whole bunch. Also, I don't like this guy. 
Have you been to the ruins of New London below? Just head down the stairs and take the lift. It's certainly worth a visit. It was once an undead city. You may find a clue or two. Unless the ghosts find you first. Yeah, ghosts. <laughs> he laughs at me a lot. Usually I've killed him by now, but... Not How this time. How did that silly sorcerer's apprentice end up? You know, the one always prattling on about Master Logan. He left for the undead burg, but never came back. Mm. Serves him right. If even old Big Hat can't make it out there, what chance does he have? I hope he enjoys his new life as a hollow. Hmm. Yeah, this is why I think I should kill him. If you think I should kill him as well, leave a comment. I'm going to set this as my spawn. And leave. Also, um... Not sure if I showed this, but Nightlord Track is here. By the Lord, your face, <laughs> your humanity is really slipping. That's there very methods. Rude. Most fools have more humanity than they know what to do with. Now, who do you imagine will make the best use of it? Mm -hmm. Probably me. Well, where have you been? Glad to see you're safe. Why, thank you, Nightlord Trek. You're much nicer than the guy up there. Much nicer than this jerk face. I really should just kill him and be done with it. But I just can't bring myself to, you know? I'm not a mass murderer who goes around murdering every NPC. You really think you can take me, huh? Go ahead. Try it. And whack! Hope you didn't have anything good. There we go. All right. And whack. Serves you right. You ugly, ugly little man. And look, other people. Wow. How'd that work for you guys? Not well, I'd say. I love the ragdoll. I also like the fact that this has a stab. So, you know, things like this, I don't want to hit the walls with. I can just poke them in the butt. With a, you know, six foot sword. Perfectly normal. Just, you know, poke, poke. Hello there. Oh, did you want to do something to me? Um, parry? There we go, a parry. Quite good. If I do say so myself. You have fire bombs, I remember this. And yet you still hit me with them. How rude. These people have no respect. Respect the giant sword. Respect it! The last thing you'll ever see until you are uh, rested a bonfire and you respawn. Oh yes, the archer. Whack. 
wonk. Alright, let's kill this bugger. Then we'll rest. Whack. No. I lied. We'll go kill these guys first. They're easy. Also, I want to see if the if the one-handed strong attack will go through their shields just as well as the two-handed did. Yup! It still goes through it! <laughs> oh, that's never going to get old. That is never going to get old, watching them just fly away. Uh, rest. And leave. You there. You look like a capable young fellow. Hmm, he didn't fly like the, the others. How disappointing. I was expecting more from him. Him, not so much. That's a good boy. And there we are. Hope you didn't need that back for anything. Oh, what do you have? Oh, a short sword. Hadn't actually gotten one of those, now that I think about it. Probably for the better, they're crap anyways. Uh, I wish this swing would hit other people around. Wonk. Yep. First sw Enough power for two swings. First to break through the shield. Second to finish them off. Most of the time. Okay. Ow. You actually managed to break through my god there. How rude. I really should kill you for that. And I think I will. I think I will kill all of you. Ooh, a battle axe! That would have been nice, I don't know, four episodes ago. Because early in the game, before you get the Drake Sword, that's like one of the best weapons. But it's a rare drop. Oops, sorry, broke your plates and stuff. Bonk. Onward. Onwards and upwards, as they say in Spain. No. No. That is someone else's. I'm not going to start to uh, plagiarizing the other YouTubers. I've already combined like three different people's be beginnings for my uh, for my intro. All right. I think uh, we're running quite low on time. Don't want to make these too long, or people won't watch. Also, if you want longer episodes, leave that down in the comments. Hmm, that didn't work. Ow. They almost killed me there. Almost is not. I'm afraid almost will is not good enough, good sir. I'm afraid you will have to do better. Oh, 
Oh look, another spear. Lovely. Lovely spears. Ah, uh, love triple digit damage. Especially when it's half of a thousand. Oh. Odd, I could have sworn I opened this before. Oh. So that's what the watchtower basement key is for. Apparently, I'm not supposed to be able to go down there until I've gotten that. Oopsies. Yeah, down there is Havel the Rock. Um, he's, he's rather large, rather powerful, and right, these guys. I always forget about them, and then they come back and try and kill me. Bonk. Bonk. There we are. Two bonks, and they are taken care of. Alright, let's run over here. Oh, by the way, did I mention that I got past the dragon? I got past him. I did not beat him, but behind him there is a, um... Bonfire that I that makes it easier to get into the undead bur um into the undead parish rather, and I open that, and that's why he's not on the bridge right now. Because when you get past him and light the bonfire, apparently he decides he's going to go away for a while. But then you go out here, run back, dragon. Yep, there's dragon. He's back. Just like that. Good old dragon. Alright. Basement key used. Alright, and uh, that is all for this time. If you enjoyed this episode of us opening this place, and I, I forget what else we did, um, yeah, leave a like, leave a comment. Stay frosted, and I will see you all next time. Wobblecopter out.